Hello, today I'm going to share with you um, a bedtime story called The Pony School News. It was the first day of school and Sweetie Belle and Scootaloo were not happy. Featherweight got his pony mark in the summer holidays, said Scootaloo. How can how can we get our pony mark? And then Apple Bloom came in. Did you hear about Diamond Tiara? She said. She has a new job at the Pony School News. We can write stories for her. Then we can get our pony mark, said Apple Bloom. Diamond Tiara talked to Sweetie Belle, Scootaloo, Apple Bloom and the other ponies. I have a lot of new ideas for this pony school news, she said. Sweetie Belle, Scootaloo and Apple Bloom wrote some stories for Diamond Tiara. Apple Bloom wrote about pony wrote in the past. Scootaloo wrote about baby animals. Sweetie Belle wrote about her favourite hats. They all gave their stories to Diamond Tiara, but she wasn't happy. This isn't news, Diamond Tiara said. Write some exciting stories. How can we find interesting stories, said Scootaloo? Then Sweetie Belle saw that something funny. Better wait, take some photographs of this. Snips and snails both had bubble gum on their bodies. The pony wrote the story for the pony school news. They called it Snips and Snails and Bubble Gum by Gabby Gums. Gabby Gums was the pony's newspaper name. All the ponies laughed when they read the story. Snips and Snails were not happy, but Diamond Tiara was very happy. Let's write lots of Gabby Gum stories, said Sweetie Belle. Then we can get our pony marks. Sweetie Belle and Scootaloo and Apple Bloom wrote lots of stories about their friends' problems. Some stories were funny, some stories were not. Now all the ponies in Ponyville wanted to read Gabby Gum stories. They ran to the school shop to buy the newspaper. Some ponies were not happy. I don't like these stories in Twilight. Gabby Gums is writing about our lives. I I I think. Gabby Gum is really funny, said Applejack. Gabby Gums must write about friends' problems, said Twilight. It's not right. The the other ponies laughed at her. We love reading about our friends' problems, they said. Sweetie Belle, Scootaloo and Apple Bloom about their friends. We want to write about other things too, they told Diamond Tiara. Diamond Tiara was angry. People only want to read Gabby Gum's stories, she said.
soon there was a new pony spawn in this video. Applejack, Pinkie Pie and Flush and Fluttershy ruled it. They began to feel angry too. Now the stories were about them. Twilight Sparkle. I am better than other ponies. Applejack is always sleeping. Pinkie Pie likes to have too much fun. Fluttershy's hair is too pink. Rarity went into her sister's room. Tweety Bell had her diary. You are Gabby Gums, Rarity said surprised. You are these terrible things. Apple Bloom and Squeakily were them too, said Squeaky Bell. We are all Gabby Gums. Rarity is very angry. The other ponies stopped speaking to Squeaky Bell, Apple Bloom and Scootaloo. We must say sorry, said Squeaky Bell. The sweetie, then Sweetie Bell wrote a note in this pony school news. Dear ponies, we are very sorry about our Gabby Gum story. We wrote them because we wanted our pony much, but we were wrong. We hope you understand. Please be our friends again. From Sweetie Bell, Apple Blue and Scootaloo. The ponies read the note. Diamond Tiara was very angry. Now no ponies wanted to read the pony school news. It's okay, we know you're, s you're sorry, the pony said to Sweetie Belle, Apple Bloom and Scootaloo. Then they gave them a big hug. It felt good to be friends again. The end. Bye-bye.